Hey guys, Tricky Boy here once again. Welcome back to PES 2016. We're in the Crestwell Master League, episode 5 right now. Um, just thought I'd start off with this little message here. As you can see, Menendez seems to be becoming more popular. The more and more and more fans are coming to matches to see him in action. So he's acquired the team role of star player level 1, which means uh, merchandise in home games will be increased if one is in the starting lineup. Now, that's obviously going to be the case most of the time. Because we really want him to be playing until we get somebody better. Um, and on that, I'm also already looking at transfers for the uh, for the transfer window. As you can see, I've got a lot of money to spend and I'm going for it. Now, Gabby Adini was on the transfer list. Obviously, doesn't want to talk to me. Vieto is a, um, a major target for me, really. He's one of my favourite Argentinian players around at the moment. Um, Cranavita also... Um, although he's from a rival team in River Plate, he's one of the best sort of prospects, if you like. Um, having just agreed to move to Atletico Madrid, um, so he's sort of the next sort of big sort of player to come out of Argentina, really. So I'm going to try and get him as well. But it didn't really work out too well because um, all three of them said no. Um, Gabbiadini was just a straight no. Um, can't lure Vieto away from Villarreal just yet, and the same for Cranavetta. Okay, so we've also got a deal in for Bonazzoli. Now, for those people that have watched my channel before, you'll know that Bonazzoli is one of my favourite players to use in uh, in Football Manager, and kind of makes sense. I'd love to sort of have him from an early age and build him up, if you like, and uh, and see what we can do. But that's just something that's going to keep going on and on and on as we go. But, um, yeah, we've got a league game now. We're going to play Aldo Civi. And then um, what I'm going to do is maybe not show the cup games. I'm going to do both cup games in one sort of video almost. So this and a bit of transfer stuff is going to be this this episode really. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to get into the game. And uh, hopefully we can get a win because the last two games have not been good performance-wise. Um, Boyer has to play. Uh, does he though? I might bring him on actually. I might just bring him on. Check TOT. Wow. <laughs> They're all making their way to Argentina in this game. Nice. So yeah, I think we're going to try and play in an away kit as well. Because they should be playing in yellow. When the kits load. Kit's going to load. Maybe not going to load. So we're going to play in... Purple and white. Okay, guys, enjoy the highlights. No! Why do you have to be so good? Oh, such a good goal. Phil Doso. Such a good finish. I'm not sure if it was a volley or a half volley. I think, I think it was a half volley, but it was such a controlled strike right in the bottom corner. And we're 1-0 down. This league is not easy so far. This is not going to plan. I mean, I knew it would be difficult, obviously, with the team we've got. But um, after the first game, I did not expect the next three games to be like this so far. Not at all. Wow, it's a, it's a lovely little flick back as well. That's just a good goal all round. If I could score that kind of goal, I'd be very, very happy. But 1-0 down, 37 minutes gone. I'd love to get back into this before half time, I really, really would. Oh, Ferreira, come on, boy. Come on, big man, do something. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, god damn it. Get the ball, get the ball. Oh, TOT, I want to break your legs so much. Ah, there's the half time whistle. So, 1 0 down so far. Not doing great. I've had a shot on target and that's it. Nothing else really happened for us at all in that first half. Really not a good first half. Not even slightly good. Let's see if we can get back into it. Second half. I want a goal like quick really. I really want a quick goal. Just to settle the nerves. Oh, no. I meant a quick goal for me, not them. Thank you. No. Ah, oh, god damn it. 
2 0. Uh, well, this wasn't planned. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. 2 0 down. We are away from home, but still. We should be uh, we should be competing against teams like this to be honest. We really should. Those kits look amazing by the way. Just to let you know. Oh dear. I don't know what is happening. It's just awful defending. Across a touch. A placed finish. Game over. It's that simple. It really is that simple, yet we can't do a damn thing about it. Oh dear. I think we need to start looking at improvements. I know obviously we've still got a very stupidly thin squad, you know, with, with obviously getting everything in place. So we are going to look at improving. We've got a lot of money to spend, um, relatively speaking, so we are going to look at spending some of that, definitely. So there we go. Final whistle. Finish 2-0. Not good. Not good at all. The stats don't even help me at all. So Doso got man of the match, as he should do with two goals. Let's go see what we are, where we are on the table now. Obviously, we're going to be down the bottom somewhere. Anything else interesting on here? Boca two, Lanus two. Uh, River play four two loss at Godoy Cruz. Wow. Okay, that's um, it's a little bit surprising that one. Where are we? 27th, wow, fourth bottom. Oh dear. One win and three losses. One win and three defeats is how we are going so far. Uh, Matutes has improved to 66, Bettini's improved to 64. That's wonderful. It is nice that you get to see all that sort of stuff. So we've got the Copa Argentina next. We've got two games against Argentinos Juniors. They will both be in episode 6. Um rather than doing it split like it is right now. So Bonazzoli broke down. Any particular reason why? High hopes for the player's future. Wonderful. Let me go and have a look. I need to get a better right winger. So let's go look at right wingers and see if we've got anybody on the transfer list. Anybody worth looking at? 568 players on the transfer list. Okay. Who is the best right winger? See, Gabby Adini would have been good. It really would have been good. Uh, any Argentinians? Zuniga. No, he's not Argentinian. Um, who do we look at here? Now we have obviously have only got one foreign player at the moment, so we could be looking at foreign players. That's definitely something we could be looking at. Um. Julio dos Santos. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Speed's not great though. But your dribbling is very good. See if you're even willing to come and talk to me. Because that would be quite nice. Pado in as well, maybe. A bit old. Uh, anybody, any other actual we might move for it's Carlos Kill. Okay. 73 now, we're getting a bit... I've got a lot of money, so I could really do with just say, just sort of going for 75 and above, really. Um, 75 and above, so... When does that end? There. Okay. So any of these guys... Ola John... Ola John might be worth a pop very quick. Ola John, screw it, let's go for you. I'm looking like for players that can play right wing, uh, right midfield rather than anything else. I mean, a lot of these guys can do it, and it's not there. I mean, Ola John is, it's not faded out, which means it's a, it's an A position, so he can play there really well. Same Mr. Santos, really. Uh, Pacheco from Betis. Kingsley Coleman, oh, how much would I love to get you? How much would I love to get you? We're going to try it. We're going to try it. Verdi from Empoli. Wayne Routledge, no, thank you. Mayada from River Plate. Wow. 
Hmm. You might be worth a pop. You might be worth a pop. Is that one more I've got I can do? Another right midfielder. Diego Roland. Suso. Leon Anderson. 21. I could build my entire team around someone like that. Oh, but he can also play in other positions as well, which might help me. Screw it. Ah, oh, damn it. So, there we go, guys. That's it for this episode. Uh, next episode, like I said, will be Copa Argentina, first leg and second leg. Um, and then also, obviously, we'll see what happens with transfers and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.